Is it okay to masturbate? Masturbation, a.k.a. sapping. A.k.a. one with a hand. Gambling is very, very important. If you are by yourself, please, oil and gas is very, very important. Self-gratification, it's... What is masturbation? I think it's pretty straightforward. Oil and gas. You oil the system, you get gas. Give me yourself uh, sexual pleasure by yourself. King's College, St. Gregory's College, all those borders, they don't know it as masturbation. They know it as gambling. If you're watching it more than once, you're playing with it, it's just gonna be masturbation. You roll dice, double six, two, four. Is it okay to masturbate? Sure, it helps relieve stress. It helps you from making stupid decisions many times. Gambling is very, very important if you are by yourself. In prison, double six. Personally, I think it's okay. I mean, as long as it's not too often and it's not too much, I don't think it should take place of anything else in your life. But if it's going to kind of keep you sane and keep you, you know, focused, <laughs> go ahead, knock yourself out. I don't know about, I don't know about, I don't know about people that masturbate because I don't do it. I just hear. As oil not help Nigeria, as gas not help Nigeria, we can help an entire nation. An individual is a minority now. Please, oil and gas is very, very important. I would say it anywhere. I mean, if at that particular moment, masturbation is going to stop you from raping somebody, go ahead and masturbate. If masturbation is going to stop you from being a menace to society, masturbate, go ahead. If it's going to make you a better person, if it's going to put a smile on your face, which it usually does for them, go ahead and masturbate. You see, I don't know. I'm just saying. Well, it can affect your sexual life, yeah. Uh, for I know for guys, it can affect your um, how erect your penis gets over time because of yeah, all the tugging and the pulling and everything. <laughs> Except you are oiling and gassing with, an heavy, with a heavy duty machine. <laughs> if that's what it's harmful. But if not, if you're doing it within the confines of the oil and gas law, I think you're fine. Masturbators are happy people. Don't let things hold them down for too long. Literally speaking. They don't, they are always free to come out anytime they want to. They speak up in public, they laugh, they smile in gatherings. They don't have girlfriend problems, they don't have relationship issues because every time somebody is stressing their life, they have their masturbating tool on standby. I think it can be healthy, but at the same time, I know it, it can also be addictive. Anything that can be healthy can have the borderline of, or the potential of being addictive as well. Uh-uh, yes, no. It's very addictive. I don't know who is more addictive, uh, who, who it's more addictive to, male or female. It doesn't really matter, but it actually gets addictive. I know a couple of people that get some like every other day, but they still cannot stop oil and gas. It's a very lucrative business, actually. Do I masturbate? What? I think almost every guy does from time to time. <laughs> <laughs> what? We're here together. Do I look like a masturbator? I mean, look at my muzzle. <laughs> no. Watching Men's Corner, Mazino is here. Andrew Blaze is here, rubbing something. I don't know what it is, bro. It's like practice. Technique makes perfect. For what he's going to do in 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we're talking 31. about- 31. We're talking 31. <laughs> okay, 31, sorry. <laughs> we're talking self-gratification on the show today. I don't know why they're calling it. Well, producer, what's wrong? We're talking masturbation. Yes, yes. Can we just call it what it is, please? Yeah, and Thank you. I will have a very direct question for both of you. Mm. Like, are you straight up. Are you a master debater? No, are you right or left? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, answer. <laughs> Right-handed or left-handed? I can't believe this. Wait, are you talking about in terms of masturbation or yes, general? Yes, masturbation. What the hell? Answer the question. I don't know. Uh. Both. Okay, <laughs> Wait, are you <laughs> I don't, think, a, I don't think there's any, any guy who is right-handed or left-handed in masturbation. You're, no, ambi no, you're ambidextrous. I, I am right -handed. No, 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 no. Really? You can't. Yeah. I'm left-handed. This is a dormant hand. I'm left-handed, actually. Yeah, no, this is a dormant hand, but I, I don't I, use this I'm, I'm fairly confident with my left hand in this one thing. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm left-handed. Oh, really? Well, so what happens to this one while you're... No, no, well, I'm talking about everything. <laughs> when it comes to everything now, everything except writing. Well, you have, writing. To, you have to hold your inspiration with one hand. <sighs> so this inspires you? No, this, this can inspire and this can perform. That's not how you uh, find right? out or what. This can no, no, let me tell you how you find out what yeah. the person is. I'm right on there, I really told you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm to find out. This left hand does, you know, all that stuff. 
to keep the, to keep the conversation <laughs> going. Okay, oh but let's boy. be serious though. Um, masturbation, it's... Do you think every guy masturbates or has masturbated at some point? Has, has masturbated. masturbated, yes. Yeah. Even priests. Yeah, <laughs> especially, most, priests. especially priests. Especially priests. <laughs> <laughs> I was not here. <laughs> My parish priest they, is watching. <laughs> they needed the most. Uh, really? Yeah, yeah. They do. Do you think it's harmful? Uh, I can't say that it's harmful except when it yes. comes to um, how, you, how it affects other habits in your life like perhaps sexual habits. Now, if you're used to self-gratification, there are chances, and I'm not saying that it's absolute, but there are chances that it would affect your um, sexual, um, vital relationships. Mm. It's actually been people. proven, yeah, over time, because mm. then you get so used to this. Exactly. And most times, <laughs> most people who masturbate, masturbate to something. Mm -hmm. It's either porn, yeah. motion, or pictures, there, or an image in your head. So whenever that is not there, mm -hmm. Even if you are with the sexiest, it's just like, mm, can I just quickly just glance at that Let me just slip, slip, <laughs> slip away for a minute. No, <laughs> masturbation is definitely, I mean, beyond, beyond just sexual performance. Um, so there's the old school of thought which would tell you things like, oh, if you masturbate, you're going to go blind. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, mom, you know that's a lie now. Yeah, not a lot of blind that's a very yeah, Not a lot of blind That's people. a very slow process then. <laughs> <laughs> right. Now on the flip side, do you think it's healthy? Uh, yeah. uh, there are people who will argue that it is healthy when it comes to um, on the other side what you could, what 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 you could do if you don't have that as a fallback as a fall to how like what <sighs> oh wait 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 you mean like sex because <laughs> what else is it distracting I met from? this guy once who said that yes he masturbates and it saves him the trouble of making a fool of himself when it comes to how he has to go about looking for sex. Or catching a disease. <laughs> or catching a disease and all that kind of thing. That so is the, his argument that is, is that. That is one of the weirdest. <laughs> that's, that's a great argument, it. but it's a weird one. It is weird, but to him, it's healthy, is, is my point. You know, he's like, I don't go through all that stress. I just go get the magazine or, <laughs> you know. You know, there's, 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 the proof that, um, there's proof that pros, is it prostate cancer? Prostate cancer, yeah. Um, can be prevented by ejaculation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And if you can't have as much sex as you should quote unquote that could also be a way of you know getting the, guess, get, getting the sack out. leaner i guess you're safe then <laughs> you're Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna say but i mean healthy healthy yeah i think it's healthy mm -hmm. um so of course you think it's healthy no no <laughs> beyond, of course I think it's got the veins on the <laughs> 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 oh no, but seriously. And by the way, by, and here's the weird thing. For all my support for masturbation, right, I also think that periodically, for as long as you can, you should starve yourself of it. Because there is, and I didn't believe this until the very first time I tried it, but there's a hardwired process that you need, at the very minimum, 90 days to reboot from. And if you stay away from masturbation long enough, you actually are able to engage in sex without necessarily falling back on the mental or physical imagery that masturbation has taught you to rely on mm. for inspiration to go through with it. And trust me, that does an entirely amazing thing to your sex life. You should try it out. While we wait for Dr. Phil to finish. <laughs> it is deep. I don't know what, how, no who shit. gets deep with his masturbation. <laughs> Masturbation, a.k.a. sappy, a.k.a. one with a hand, handsome, a.k.a. just me, myself, and I. Masturbation is the act of helping yourself to reach orgasm, I believe. <laughs> Masturbation is self-gratification, it's self-pleasure, it's being there for yourself when nobody is uh, going to be there for you, you know? That is when you take good pleasure in your own body to release some certain tension because you cannot pay for it or have it for free, you know. So you have to do it by yourself. This is what I call DIY. Yeah. If you're coming from the biblical aspect when the Bible is it's not a Christian thing, I guess, to masturbate. But, um, you know, sometimes not everybody can get help from other people. And sometimes there's nobody else to help you. And you have this need that you need to, or you have this thing that you need to get rid of. So, you know, you have to sort of like help yourself. And 
yeah, so at, at times like that, I feel like it's not, it's not, it's, it's acceptable. Yeah. Help yourself. Of course it's okay to masturbate. What are you going to do? What, what, what do you really want to do? I, I don't get it. You have to, you have to, this life. Everybody has their own form of letting go. So yeah, I feel it's okay. Why not? Carry on. It's life. Yes. Yes, it is. How else will you be able to stay away from making bad decisions on a Saturday night? When you're alone and your salary just came in. You better stay home. Buy some lotion. If I can bring some over for you. No. Buy it yourself. Go ahead. My school of thoughts is just don't even do it at all. Like sexual acts in general, my school of thoughts is, you know, the, the Lord's way. Stay away. Stay completely. People feel like it's a, uh, eh, no, they want this holier than that. They want people to perceive them in a certain type of way. Truth is, at some point in our lives, at least between 15 and say 20, 21, yeah, we all do. do what is, I, no, I don't masturbate. Nope, I do not masturbate. It doesn't even work for me. Trust me, I've tried. No, I do not masturbate. I do not, I repeat, I do not masturbate, okay? <sighs> Take me I have a feeling my pastor is watching. Um, 